All right, y'all, one box of Orange Supreme Cake Mix. Into this, we gonna add one stick of melted butter, just like so, all right? Now, fun part, mixy, 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 mixy. Uh, all right, y'all, so we just wanna get this incorporated. It don't have to be perfect, all right? One stick of butter, one box of cake mix. This is a versatile, customizable recipe. Y'all are gonna love this. Um, so this Orange Supreme Cake, I know some of y'all have asked me about this before. I honestly have never seen it at my local store, but I ordered it on Amazon. It came in like a three pack. So if y'all ever want to try it, it's real good, real good. All right, y'all, so once it's mixed pretty well, that's actually good enough. This is just kind of like crumble. We're just gonna put this in the bottom of our grease to nine by 13, all right? And you know what, y'all, get in there and use your hands if you have to. It's your best kitchen tool. All right, so I'm just gonna break this apart a little bit and spread it at the bottom of our grease baking dish. I love using box cakes like this because you have some, uh, it's kind of like, makes like a crumble crust. It's just delicious. So that's just perfect how it is. All right, y'all. On top of that, here I have uh, some frozen whole strawberries, but I thawed these out most of the way, all right? Because we want to get rid of a lot of that uh, liquid. So these are pretty thawed out. So one package of the frozen strawberries that are thawed out. Y'all can also use strawberry pie filling, but I didn't have any. All right, now we're taking one can of pineapple chunks. I drained these, so this is going right on top, all right? There's a little juice left in there, but that's totally fine. It's going to be delicious. All right. And then another thing we add here, y'all, this is optional, but I have some chopped up walnuts. I think this is real good with this recipe, so we're just going to do a nice layer right on top like so. All right, as much or as little as you'd like. I like the little crunch it gives. All right, y'all, we have one more step here. I'm putting this bowl right on top. And uh, now I have a box of white cake mix. We're gonna dump that into our bowl, all right? So my new favorite thing to do, y'all, when I make dump cakes is to do double crust. I just think it tastes better. So you need a, a stick of butter and a box cake mix per crust. So if you wanna use, if you want two crusts, you use two. And y'all, the possibilities are endless. The combinations y'all can do, it's just, it's totally endless. Fruits, whatever. But it's honestly my new favorite way to make a quick and easy dessert or to make a cake because everybody always loves it. I just love doing the cake mixes this way. The crumble topping is so good. All right, so we're gonna get this nice and incorporated. Um, yeah, so I have the one orange supreme cake and one white cake. But again, y'all, use whatever kind you'd like. If I had like, they have a strawberry supreme cake, that would have been good. Even yellow cake, like I said, there's so many options, all right? So once that's nice and mixed, I'm just gonna move this bowl. And at this part, I like to use my hands, all right? So we're just gonna do the crumble right on top of our pineapple, our strawberries, our walnuts, and our, uh, our double crust at the bottom, which is the orange supreme cake mix, which is so good, y'all. All right, so we just sprinkle, sprinkle this all over, breaking up those big chunks. You can just let it fall where it wants to, y'all. That's, that's it. So easy. So easy, so delicious. Y'all can do this with fresh fruit if you want. Um, like I said, the possibilities are completely endless. All right, so we're going to put this in the oven at 350, usually about 35 to 40 minutes. But y'all can tell when the, when the crumble topping starts turning a little golden brown. That's how y'all know it's done, all right? I can't wait to show y'all one of my favorite easy double crust dump cakes. All right, y'all, so here we have our uh, delicious dump cake we just took out of the oven a few minutes ago. Um, so remember, we used the orange cake on the bottom, pineapple, strawberries, some walnuts, and then white cake on the top. So time to, time to scoop some up and serve it. I'm going to put some right on my plate here. Oh, my goodness, y'all, this is going to be so good. The combination of the orange cake with the fruit and the nuts, double crust. I just love it, y'all. All right, so I have some on my pretty green plate here. I also like to have this with a little bit of Cool Whip right on top, maybe a little bit more. All right, y'all, we gonna turn the camera around and I'm gonna try this, I'm so excited. All right, y'all, time to try our dessert, but first little Kevin wanted to say hi. Look how fluffy his tail is, <laughs> he's so fluffy. He's like, mama, put me down, I wanna go back to sleep. I love you, baby, I love you, say bye. They all love you, boopy. That's his nickname, y'all. His nickname is Boopy. He's my little baby. He's just sitting right here by my feet. All right, y'all, here we have our delicious dump cake. We use that orange cake mix, some fruit, and uh, I'm excited. That's it. It's going to be real hot, but that's all right. Mmm, 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 y'all. Okay. Mmm. 
Y'all, this orange cake mix is so good. The flavors go so well with the strawberry and the pineapple. Mm, and the walnuts, y'all, this is so good. Y'all have to try this.